going on, everybody? It's Shane. And it's Natasha. We're pops and shit still hiding. <laughs> there. Today we have another video with a mail call and two mystery boxes that we're going to be doing in a uh, competition. Uh, I was about to say challenge, but that's just because of the name of the box. With the mail call, this is an Amazon order that I did. Um, it's two pieces from my Game of Thrones set that I didn't have that were on sale with their like large pop sale. Anything that was like a six inch was almost half off. That was the only reason I bought these. So yeah, let's just show these. They're a little bit older, but just to show them off. They're only older because they came out when season three Correct. was going on. So the final season, actually these were I think after because one of them was in. One of them was after. Yeah. The other one came out like during. I think both of them were after. I think the ones on the throne came out after. Hinting at Tyrion Lancer on the throne. Ooh, he's funny. Which, you know, as Amazon does, has a huge sliced mark right down. Oh, middle. and it's a little bent in. Right? And it's bent it's in, but you know, this is coming out of box. He is too cool to keep in box. So there's there's number one, and then number two, which she was hinting at, happened during the season and why they couldn't release it early. But they do that sometimes, and they yeah. spoil stuff. And it's annoying. But we have the Daenerys and Jorah moment where they're um, saving each other's lives, and it's super awesome. And That's bigger than what I thought it was going to be. It's kind of huge. Yeah, it's kind of nice. Now. That's what she said! Yeah, <laughs> mail calls. I got them. They were both 50% off. So the only way I was going to buy these is if they were like 10 bucks, and that's exactly what it was. And with the mystery box that we have today, we do have a Chrono Toys. Challenger series it's week two of the May. May, 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 May. And the five big hits that they released out of the 500 boxes. If you don't know what the Challenger series is, it is 500 box release. They are. They're pretty show. cheap. They're pretty cheap. They're 500 boxes. Slim. the cheap. Slim odds. Not against. So, what we're going to do in this is we're going to each open all four of our boxes, you know, sign back to back, not simultaneously. Yeah. And uh, we're going to compare value at the end, see who wins. It's going to be based off pop price guide. Let's get into it. You want to go first? You want me to go first? I'll have you cut yours. I have the knife. Yeah. yeah. So, you should probably just do it first. I don't know if these are in sorted or not. I'll take a peek. They are in sorted. We're good. Well, I would hope so. We've got four separate mystery boxes. You never know. Yeah. Yep, so this is what they look like when you first open it. They're all in their own individual box, which is nice. They can see through the bubble wrap, or you can feel through the tape. There is bubble wrap. Yep. So you guys might be able to see it in there, you might not. They do take these up on either end, if not the front. So, oh, still not looking. I don't know, I see you look. I don't, I can't tell who that is. She's looking. She's, she's eyeballing. I don't know who it is. Oh, I know who it is. Is that James Brown? Yeah. The new one? That one's actually cool. He will be going in the collection. I flipped the flap up so it would be a little bit easier just to show you. Oh, still bubble wrapped. Yep. I did not touch it. It looks like the Kool-Aid Man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so Kool-Aid Man. This is actually kind of cool. He's pretty good at not looking. I'm pretty bad at it. Especially when it's right in the line of sight. I mean, it depends on if it's the chase or not. I can't tell. Joker, which we have somewhere in here. He is actually out in the living room. Somewhere's out there. Yep. It is not the chaser, but this is actually holding pretty good value because people are buying it a lot, trying to get that chase. Yeah, so I will show you guys first. I could not see what it was. There is a nice flare on bubble wrap. You should try, I'm really bad at this. Try not to look and unwrap it. I'm going to look just like you looked at mine. Is it a good one? At least. I think you already have this one. Some TV show. Wait, you don't have this one. In the comic book version of a TV show. Oh, the Archie comics! So, I actually do have almost all the Riverdale. I got rid of the dream sequence and I'm missing Reggie Mantle. I don't think they've released him. I haven't seen him in stores. Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't there the one that's like hiding? Yeah, Reggie Mantle. I'm missing. I will be keeping her. I really do like the way she looks. She reminds me of like the 50s almost poodle skirt vibe. 
Which I cool, really cool Yeah. I like her. She turned oh, up. I like how they're releasing the RG Comics now. Yeah. As alongside Riverdale. It's kind of cool. Especially since people know these characters, whether it's from the comics or not. It super confused me when I first seen the Archie Andrews one, and I'm like, we don't have that one, and then I realized it's not Riverdale. <laughs> Seriously, I was super confused. Yeah. So, on to my next one. Still not looking. Hiding it from her, so she can't look. Oopsies. I got the back. Ooh, this one is a keeper. Oh, that's a pinhead. Oh, the golden. Glow in the dark, overseas sticker. I don't know where that was shared with initially. Probably Hot Topic because they get a lot of horror. Mm -hmm. But it could be like FYE. This was. I don't have a release date on here. Some of them do and some of them don't. Some of them That's a keeper though. Yep. That'll well, go right in the horror behind us. Right in the horror. Yep. That's his one big series other than Game of Thrones. Yep, horror and uh, Game of Thrones are mine. Yes. And I almost, I have a lot of the Game of Thrones. So you kind of threw the full board out. Number three. What is that? Ultraman! Oh, it's not Ultraman though. Kane, no. Kane Don. I've never seen Ultraman. I've never seen Ultraman either. Is it a movie? Uh, TV oh. it says. Is it on Netflix? I don't think so. Or <laughs> I probably would have watched it. Then. Because I have seen quite a few different Ultraman variants. And the new Ultraman is actually going in a lot of like uh, top prize mystery boxes now, so he must be worth something. Yeah. Sorry, I totally threw off your stack. That's fine. <laughs> On to my last, but not least. Let's see, just ballparking on what I have already in these three, what she has, I do believe I am in the lead. I don't know if you can see this over here or not. I, I forgot what the framing is. Oh yeah, and you got Kool-Aid Man. I don't know if he's loving much. Maybe the 4 inches. I have never seen the 4 inches so... Uh, not much. This feels... I'll go like this so I don't see. I can tell you that pinhead is really cool. Oh, I yeah. totally thought I felt the protector, but it wasn't. It was just a little bit up. It was just a super sharp corner on the box. Oh, yeah. I hope that's one I don't know. Hey! Hola. Bernie. Bernie. The little fire lizard. Oh, Frozen 2, that's why. I haven't paid much attention. I haven't watched that yet. Have I, I have. I haven't watched you it haven't. yet. You were in here gaming. I asked if you wanted to watch it, and you said no. I am not looking as I'm flipping the flaps. Even if I did, there's huge glare on bubble wrap. Yeah, we have a light right behind the camera. Yup. And it's shining right into my eyes, so... Ooh, I just that is a dupe with kit out of the boxes. Can you guess which one without looking? I already looked. Oh, he's even tilted forward. So he's already coming out of the So what that can tell us is we can have a fit head on the card. Yeah. <laughs> I win by two. You cheated. No, I didn't. I couldn't have. What's going on, guys? It's Shane. I'm recording. Or I'm editing the video right now in the... Uh, post-production sides of it here on my computer and uh, I noticed the competition values were wrong saying that Natasha would have won but at the time of the recording her evaluation on the values of the pops that we pulled were actually higher than mine so we're gonna go with what happened at the time of the recording and not the time of editing this might happen in the future as well and just know that editing values are what we're gonna be putting in the videos not the recording values because we're not writing them down we're not doing any of that and it's been a few weeks since we um, recorded this video so yeah thanks for watching make sure you leave a like comment comment down below what's your favorite poll of today's video and you have a good one bye she cheated we both had two that were valued at retail and two that were at 29 yeah you won because who had and, and pull up That's, yep. that was the war it's because so clearly three, three of the same values and then these two these right here. Yep, these guys. 11, 9. I win because I got Kool-Aid. That's tied. Ooh, we're tied on the season. 3 3. Dang. Dang. Wow. Wow. We'll pop some shit. We'll be back with episode whatever number. We can't decide if it's 4, 5, or 6. And there will be a few mail calls coming up. Yeah, mail calls will be next. Yep. I got a few of those coming And uh, I think we're going to show off some pops out of box. Kinda Test our waters with like a, a review style thing where we 
kind of just go over the mold itself. Yep, because there are some cool molds that we already have in the collection. And it, you can also, either it's already came out or you can expect it here soon, a collection video, kind of a tour of our abode. Yeah, and it's kind of hard to show some of it because out in the living room we have three deep on my side of the couch, so you will not be seeing at least a third of the collection unless I move them all. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to move them all. You're kidding. Because they're all going to go that wall, right? Not all of them. Some of them. Some of them are in the front. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, do a lot of stuff. I haven't said that yet, so. Took us, took us 30 minutes of recording to even think about saying that. True. Leave we will leave add a, it. <laughs> leave a comment. We're not even worried about the likes and subscribes right away. No, this is just kind of to test the waters. This is this is kind of like a documenting our purchases in a sense. Like we're it's like a It's a fun way for us to get creative while quarantined. Quarantined and showing stuff off that we actually enjoy. Yeah. Yeah. Eventually, yeah. there will be yep. more variety of collectibles. <laughs> yeah. Eventually, we'll have like side show, uh, statues and stuff like that. Yeah, that's and the shit part of it. Yeah, the, the shit. Yeah, the shit. It's not actually shit. No. It's yeah. probably just way more expensive than pops. That's yeah, that's why it's there. We call a lot of shit the expense of shit. Because <laughs> it's expensive. Very. Very. Very expensive. Again, I'm Shane. And I'm Natasha. We were pops and shit. Appreciate it.